Hi, I'm Henry Lee, BlueHeronArts.com. Thanks for joining me in this uh, seal engraving or carving video. Uh, today's uh, project is a very tiny, tiny small stone, name stone or name chalk for Mr. Wang K. Wang, or Philip Wang. Uh, Philip has a Chinese name. Uh, last name Huang, pronounced as Wang in Cantonese, and uh, Qi or Kai in Cantonese, and uh, Hong in Cantonese is Wang, Kai Wang. So, according to the size of the stone, you can either do one character with uh, uh, the last name Huang or two characters, uh, depending on how many strokes. So in this case, we try to fit in this uh, um, first name, K Wang, or in can, uh, Mandarin Chinese, Qi Hong. Uh, and um, Philip wants to use uh, the same seal script as uh, in the Jet Li's movie, uh, The Hill, in Qing Dynasty. So if you check uh, online to see the, the movie reference, you will find uh, this similar writing that looks like this. Uh, it has a long kind of a leg or sharp, um, with sharp point. In a rectangular uh, shape composition. So this is the this Qing seal script. It's uh, the standard uh, script used for unification of China. Before that, there were bronze scripts, more pictograph, pictographic. So um, it might look more like uh, images. We call that uh, uh, great seal script. This is known as a small seal script. So uh, we have designed uh, both uh, yan, like uh, in this little, little seal here, and yin, which is negative carving. And uh, Philip likes the yin carving. So we are going to use this as a uh, um, this carving style. Pour a little bit acetone liquid. Let it evaporate a little bit. And then press. And you can use a uh, plastic to rub it. That's better. See? I made it. So I'm going to carve this one now. Qi. You don't have to cut that deep. Just use the corner of the uh, cutting knife. It's very meditative you know, to control your breath. So it's one stroke per line, it's very challenging. It's only uh, nine millimeter or th uh, three eighths of an inch. This is small little stone. It's very good for uh, artist trading cards or greeting card in small scale miniature painting or calligraphy. Okay. And I turn the stone, you see, when I get the curve. I 
it merged two vertical lines um, shared uh, they shared the one line so this line is very subtle it's used to um, both both sides so we want to make it a little bit heavier but not too much that's a long shot The stone is not even, so sometimes you use cutting to overcome resistance. Okay, that's one character. The second one, Hong. We normally don't use the sharp point, but uh, in some occasion I do use them for very fine lines. Um, I rather use the flat side of the knife. You have uh, the two side knife like this. This is one kind of stroke. It takes a long time to to learn to develop. It has all the turns and curves, lift and the pressing, um, all the movement in one single stroke. It's like calligraphy. Okay, <coughs> just make uh, the corners rounded. And also the edge. All right. Let's take a look by making a first imprint. Oh, that comes out pretty good, I think. Now I'm going to make an official imprint in my album. This is uh, my fifth, um, sixth um, collection album. I published uh, the first five in an e-book. You can take a look and uh, it's indexed to 207 videos like this. So you can not only see the different carving styles, but the process I did in the uh, e-book with the input e-book and the style guide. Uh, when you place the order with me, you'll get the e-book for free. It's a downloadable PDF with the hyperlinks to YouTube videos like this. Very nice. And 
uh, also, also make one for Philip. We have a special fine uh, rice paper for this purpose. So you can have a clear copy if you want to put on your business card. There is a little chip on this uh, corner that helps you to identify the orientation. It's on the left side. Sometimes I use a mark, natural mark on the stone. Sometimes the signature can also help. That's a nice copy. Finally, I'd like to thank uh, Philip for your commissioning of doing this uh, name seal. And I'd like to thank everybody on YouTube for watching and uh, I appreciate uh, your support. Goodbye.